My name is Joan Oxich, and welcome to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Uh, one second. Ah, much better. Ah, much better. Sorry, folks. What's wrong? I'm getting a little bit confused now. Anyway, anyway, our next contestant is very, very awesome and cool. Because one of you is about to win a million dollars. That's right. They're about to becoming the next millionaire. Yes. How about that? Talk about that. Just off the hook. Um, don't you think? But too bad. Well, too bad. Too bad. Because I'm not doing this. You know that who wants to become the next million dollar victorious? Well. Anyway, next up, we are. Callie and Marie from Split 2. Yes. So come up here. Let's play Who Wants to Be. Who Wants to Be. Who Wants to Be. So come on now to the hot seat. You're the next player. That's very nice, but anyway, uh, Kelly Marie from Splatoon. They're a pop and musician and sing that they want to win a million bucks. However, however, if they want to win the money, they don't have to win it exactly when it's gonna happen. But uh, well, what happen is, if they don't answer this question, well, they're out of the game. But still, I don't care. But I don't care. Anyway, how you feel? Well, I'm glad. Well, I'm so glad that you could be next. Anyway, with a million dollars. Oh, no, Yeah, we've done it cherry drop Oh, that's very nice. And how much? This is for them. $250,000. Oh, $250,000. Oh, that's, that's nice. Oh, that would be nice. Alright, Calvary, $500,000 each, and off the hook. The $250,000 should take I, four of them. I <laughs> uh, well, you know all that. All depending on the end, please. Please. Kelly and Marie, do the song your favor. Um, Kelly and Marie, can you do me a show favor to me? To do any talk this news? Even though it's not, is this in Fox? Because it's Fox News, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes, you're right. Do it up. Can you do this? Sure, why not? Okay. I'll go on to your testicles. It's in Coppola's news time. Well, the holidays are here again, and we have something very special for all of you. I sure hope it's something important, Callie. We're going to 
holds a special concert at the Incopolis Plaza for the annual Incopolis Tree Lighting Ceremony. I never thought I'd say this, but that sounds special. Indeed, Marie. We haven't planned something like this since we performed during the Splatfest. In addition to the special event, everyone will also be able to take part in annual holiday gift exchange. That's right! During the holiday gift exchange, everyone has the chance to bring a gift to any of your friends, whether it's an inkling or a friendly octoling. That's pretty clever of you, Callie. Well, we hope to see you again real soon with more updates from Ecopolis News. Happy holidays, everyone! Until next time, stay fresh! That's nice, but it's not Christmas. Oh, really? Yeah. But anyways... Wait, is phones gonna be over with the episode with John Brangman? Yeah. Just... Um... Okay, that's very nice in compass. But now, it's time to play the big money! But now, it's time to play for the big money! Okay. Okay, Kelly and Marie, you know how this works. All you have to do is to ask me. So, so answer a series of questions. Uh, I mean, 15 questions. You must answer 15 questions. Only. You must answer 15 questions correctly if you want you girls want to win a million dollars. The rules are simple. Once you win $1,032,000, you're guaranteed to leave you with that much money. And you also have three lifelines to help you along the way. 50-50 where a computer will take away two of the correct answers and just one correct answer one remaining right answer. Follow the credit where you can call one of your friends and say what they think is the outside of the digital and have 30 seconds to help them out. And finally, ask the audience, which is contacting 100 people, to see what they think is the correct answer. So you can wipe. If at any point the questions get too tough, you can walk away at any point. Or if they get a question wrong, no matter how you walk away or get a question wrong. If you walk away, you're going home with exactly what you wanted for your charity. Get it wrong and you will drop back down. So with the rules are understand it, are you ready to play? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. Let's play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire with Kelly and Marie as Squid Sisters. Alright girls, here is the first question for $100. Which country was Turkish delight originating from? Is it Greece, Italy, Turkey, Ukraine? That's a Kenya. Yeah, it's a Turkey. Yep, Turkey. My right, so. It is Turkey. You got it. One hundred dollars. Excellent start. Yes. Turkish delight is a sticky candy coated with powdered sugar. All right, here it is for 200. Who was the founder of Apple? You know, the co-founder, of course. Steve Jobs, Bill Gates, Linus Torvaldol, Steve Ballmer. And not B or D. Okay, not B and D. Bill Gates, Steve Ballmer, Microsoft. So we're left with Linus Torvaldol and. Steve Jobs. It's a Steve Jobs. Yep, Steve Jobs. Fine. Okay. The co founder of Apple was Steve Jobs. You got it. Well done. $200. Alright, for oh, 300 The touch Mahal. Oh no. I think, I think it's something. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna try this again. The Taj Mahal. The Taj Mahal was located in which Asian country? Ah, much better. Was it Nepal, Bangladesh, Bhutan, or India? Really? Yeah, 
India. Yep, India. Five hundred. That is correct! Well done! Nine dollars! Alright, this is question number four for five hundred. Here it is. What is seventy-five plus plus sixty? Uh, 105, 120, 135, 150. It's 135. Yep, 135. Right. It's the right answer! You got $500! Okay, this is it. Answer this next question. And you bank $1,000, girl. For $1,000, take a look at this. For a guarantee. $1,000. In which room was the name called the Granny Smith? Are there bananas, or kiwis, their apple, or the orange? That's an apple. Yep, apple for one. It's the right answer! You got one thousand dollars! Yeah. Okay, question number six for two thousand. Here it is. Who is the main character of Disney? You know, Walt Disney, obviously. Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse, Goofy, Donald Duck. Oh, that's an easy one. Yeah? Mickey Mouse. Yeah, it's Mickey Mouse. Final answer. Those an A, Mickey Mouse. I hope that hurts, listen, boy. Well done! It's the correct answer! Yeah! Yeah! Alright. We're not away from a million. Here it is for 4,000. In which U.S. state was Seattle located in? North Dakota, Washington, Nevada, New York. Well, I've never been into America before, right? Yeah. Well, well, you should be. Well, because you were the king first in North America, but too. Right now. Right now. Looks like we caught the express now! Let's say B, Washington. Yeah! Okay. Let's say B, Washington. Yep! Yeah. That's our final answer. Okay, final answer B, Washington! You just won $4,000! Well done! Excellent! Doing great so far! Alright, this question will get you halfway. I mean, over halfway. Here it is for 8,000. Which Monsters Incorporated character that Bruce sang? Oh, baby! Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Which Monsters Incorporated character that Bruce sang? But, but that the Batman came from. But that the Batman came from. Or so help me. So help me. So help me. And cut. <laughs> James P. Sullivan, Mike Wazowski, George Sanderson, Henry J. Waternoose the third, which is Mr. Waternoose, of course. Obviously. Ew. We never watched we never watched Monsters Incorporated. And I never heard about the music before. Yeah, me too. Never watched it. I think it need some help. Okay, which one would you like? The girls, three lifelines. We like to ask the audience. Yeah. Gentlemen, let's ask the audience. Okay, you girls want to ask the audience. Audience, Kelly and Marie need your help. If you're ready, on your keypads, using A, B, C, or D, vote now. Oh, would you look at that? 53% Mike Wazowski, 28% James B. Sullivan, 13% George Sanderson, and only a small 6% Henry J. Waternews the third. Come on. Okay. Thank you very much, audience. Okay, we're gonna trust the audience. Yeah. We're trusting the audience, we're saying, B, Mike was asked. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Is that your final answer? Yeah. Yep. Okay. And... 
Yeah, the water's good. I think I was just saying. But the name I first came from, or so of me, that answers in copyrighted characters. Mike Wazowski, you got it! Yeah. Well done, audience. You're a smiling all over your face. Alright, we're seven away from a million. You're over halfway there. Now, take a look at this for $16,000. Here we go. What is the name of the puzzle that translates into single number? That's right. That was originated in Japan. Jigsaw, Rubik's Cube, Sudoku, Crossword. That's the end. I know this answer. Yeah, me too. It's Sudoku. I'm gonna say B, Sudoku. I'm gonna say C, Sudoku. Yeah? Yeah. Let's do it. C, Sudoku. Final answer. That's the right answer! That was a yeah. That's right. So, Kola was originated in Japan. That it is translated into a single number from the early years of puzzle. Alright, answer this next question right, and you're guaranteed to leave here with $32,000, girls. Here it is. How many seconds are in three minutes? 45 seconds, 90 seconds, 135 seconds, 180 seconds. Okay, 180. 180? Yeah, 45 times 4 is 180. Yeah, 180. D, final answer. Yeah, D, final answer. And you just got $32,000! Yeah. Well done. Man, you quite make me nervous. Here it is for $64,000. In what year was Madagascar 3? Europe's most wanted release was one of the answers 2004, 2008, 2012, 2016. Take your time. Take where will everyone get their screen now? But if you get wrong, it doesn't matter. You still got thirty-two thousand dollars. However, if you get it right, you double your thirty-two into sixty-four. Fifty thousand dollars? Yes, we're playing for sixty-four thousand dollars. Just over sixty grand. Obviously, it's over fifty thousand. But. Still got two lifelines right now, but you cannot walk away with thirty-two thousand dollars. Thirty-two thousand dollars. You can play the question, or use a lifeline. But hey, you can still play with the question. I still got two lifelines to use. We released in two thousand and twelve. 2012. Final answer C. 2012. I asked you in what year was Madagascar 3 Europe's most wanted release? You said 2012. Congratulations! You just won $64,000! Yes! Yay! <laughs> Well done! And of course, the, the Nintendo Wii U was released in 2012. That's right! Good job! Alright, we're on the 12th question. Here it is for $125,000. Here it comes. In which country is only USA, 
UK, Italy, Norway. Okay. It's also on Europe, really, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. I know it. I know all over Europe. But two games. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. BBC? It's United Kingdom. Yeah, it's United Kingdom. United Kingdom. You say UK. Is that your final answer? Yep, B UK. Let's find out if only fools and horses was said in the UK. Is it UK? Sure. Oh my gosh, it's the right answer! Yes! Yeah! Well done! 125! thousand dollars it was actually in BBC only fools and horses all right here it is question number 13 for two hundred and fifty thousand dollars which sea was the country that borders Egypt Mediterranean Persian North Adriatic it's not Adriatic yep it's not Adriatic or but what but what but what star has the sea Adriatic? Uh 4.7. I love going to Montenegro with the beautiful Adriatic Sea. Yeah. But we don't know about geography. But how do you know? Oh. Hey. Wait, we're gonna phone a friend. Yeah! We're phoning a friend! Okay! It's a 50-50 lifeline. Yeah, yeah, 50-50 lifeline. We're gonna use it now. Okay, 50-50 it is. Computer, would you please take away two wrong answers leaving just Kelly and Marie the right answer and one remaining wrong answer. Whew, thank God you didn't go for the friend because it's gone. All right, Mediterranean or Adrian? Good thing you used the 50-50 lifeline. Now that is a helpful information. Good job, 50-50. <laughs> All right. Thank God you didn't go with that C. Now choose one of the two answers, Mediterranean. Yeah. Or you can walk away with the $125,000. We're going to play. Yeah. A, Mediterranean. Final answer. Yes, and yes, final answer. Well, thank you for, thankfully, you used your 50-50 lifeline because friend gave it, gave it a wrong answer. Mediterranean, that borders Egypt. Which is A, the... Correct answer! Yeah! $250,000 richer! But you can get even more bigger now. But now you're gonna get even more bigger than this. This 
question is worth five hundred thousand dollars. Here it is. The question. In which war was Adolf Hitler recently died in 1945 at the age of 56? Yeah. Okay, what's the answer? We teach that on history. World War II. Yes. Yeah, World War II. Okay, let's see one of the answers. World War I. World War II. Balkan War. Hundred Years War. Speed. World War Two. You gotta play. Yeah, we're gonna play. Yeah, we're gonna play. The World War Two final answer. Wow, you risked two hundred eight, two hundred and eighteen thousand dollars. B. World War Two. Kali, Marie. I don't know what to say. In this. How am I supposed to do that? <laughs> well, World War II nowadays because Callum Marie, you're a half a million dollars richer! Yes! What a tough play game! What a pair contestant player! Half a million dollars, five hundred thousand dollars. Kelly Marie, you are now you are now just reached the final question, the question of all time, because you have no lifelines left. This is it. Get ready for the final question. All right, Kelly Marie, take a deep breath. For a million dollars, here it is. The question. Which The Simpsons characters is the Hindi man that works at Cookie Mart known as 7-Eleven? Here are four possible answers. Edna Krabappel. Seymour Skinner. Abu Nahasapima Petalon. Clancy Wiggum. Me and Kelly went to 7 Eleven, right? Yeah. But I know. But we know this answer. Oh my god! We're gonna go for it. They're gonna go for it! They're gonna go for it! Every... The girls are gonna risk $468,000! What's your final answer? C. C. Abuna Hasapima Petalon. Yeah, C. Abuna Hasapima Petalon. That's our decision. See, Abu Nahasapima Pentalon, final answer. All right, now the question is, which the Simpsons character, Simpsons character is the Hindi man who works at Quickie Mart known as 7-Eleven. Kelly Marie, you went with C, Abu Nahasapima Pentalon. Now it's just about time for the moment of truth. I am gonna end the suspense right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Kelly Marie is the victorious! Yeah! You are done! I couldn't have done this before, but you got it. You girls got it. One million dollars. Oh my. Oh. You girls are one a million dollars on who wants to be a millionaire. And you still want to share Pearl Marina off the hook to donate them? Where is the heart now? <laughs> Oh yes! Oh, hold on, hold on just a sec. Something's happening. Yellow. Oh, this is Captain Goldfish. 
Oh, can't come for us. What do you want? German, I'm cool. I can't come fish. It's very hot outside. It's very beautiful. Then I I need to warm up the place. No, you don't. It's hot outside. Even if it's fall or winter. Whatever. I need to turn up the heat. No, it will become worse. <laughs> I need to warm up. Please. Oh. No, 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 no. I can't. Oh. Where's Kelly Marie? Oh, they have one million dollars. What? How? I just answered all the questions right. Uh, what the? Still, they don't care. I'm gonna wait until winter? Uh, you should be. You have to wait until winter. That was Ken Goldfish. Ken Goldfish? Why? Oh, don't worry. But yeah, girls, congratulations! The million dollars is all yours. How does it feel? You know, we're pretty good. Um, yeah, we're pretty good. Oh, hold on. Oh yeah, they are pretty, pretty good. And I have a new sound thing for this total points money. Well, Kelly Marie, had you fun on who wants to be a millionaire? We should. Yeah. Oh, that's very nice. Anyway, I give them a huge round of applause for Kelly Marie. The million dollar winners! All who wants to be a millionaire. Thank you for playing, Kelly Marie. And enjoy a million dollars and share with Pearl Marina as they're off the hook. And the four of them are splitting $250,000. Enjoy it! Thank you! Thank you. Bye! Goodbye! And that's it! That's gonna be another episode of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I'm, I'm not done. I'm not done. Well, guys, Callie and Marie has done it. They have won one million dollars. Maybe we can become another million dollars richer. And who wants to be a millionaire? And so for everyone here at Millionaire, I've been Jovan Alexic. Thank you for watching. And you'll see you on the next episode. From New York, everybody. Good night.